any knowledgeable trade unionist must know and be aware of the incoming president. If he's a person who will grow economy, who will put some mechanism in place to spur the economic growth for purposes of expanding employment opportunities, so that when the economy is performing well, you can now demand for better terms and conditions of service of your members. You cannot sit until when a thief or a looter or anybody else is elected and then you start making noise, oh, our government is not doing this. Uh, we must stop anybody who is a looter. We must stop anybody who is not a thief. We must stop an unscrupulous person. We must stop anybody who has no uh, goodwill for Kenyans. We must stop him. We must, and we will stop him. We will. That is our work. It's not that who elected are going to do this. That is the work of the pressure group. The independence of Latin America, Asia, and Africa came through trade unions. In Kenya, when all political leaders were detained at the Kiburi House in town here, it was only the trade unionists who were talking. That is why Tom Boy emerged as a negotiator for our independence. He met Dr. Kwame Nguruma those early days. He went to U.S., met the Kennedys. Uh, he came from the trade union movement. So let nobody sleep thinking that he is safe so long as I'm breathing and kicking. I will narrow down to him. I will. I will. I can assure you for free. So all plans, are, uh, all plans about the meeting have been completed. And uh, let me tell you, there will be no disruption. That one you can take it from me for free. They, they, we, did, we will not have any disruption of any kind of that meeting. No any disruption at all. Uh, because Kenya is a democracy. Kenya has a government. We have also the supporters of that particular meeting. And they will not allow anybody to come there drunk or sent or organized or paid or something like that. Now, I want to warn top politicians who are daydreaming that they still have people. We, are, we, are, we, have, we, are, we have seen the ratings today. What it tells you about your political party, what it tells you about your political participation, what it tells you about your political position. So look at it and try to improve your own position instead of poking your noses in a well organized uh, Western Kenya meeting. Security arrangements, I think government has done enough. We have been assured by the government that nobody should panic to come. And uh, not only that, we have also made our own local arrangement to beef up uh, the efforts that are being made by government. The agenda of the meeting, one, is a political direction to the people of Western Kenya. That is the main agenda, political direction. We want to plant a sense of direction. We don't want to be bystanders. We, want be, we don't want to be fence, you know, fence sitting, uh, fence sitters or people sitting on the fence while waiting to see what is happening inside there. We want just to be inside. We want to enter into the mainstream of uh, of, of, of the political on the political arena uh, and give a direction uh, to where the country is going. We don't want uh, a government to be formed. Uh, when the Western Kenya people are not part and parcel of it. When I say I've invited Msari Amdaba de Kalonzo Msioka, I've invited Gideon Moy, I've invited Cyrus Jirongo, uh, Wetangula, that is the composition of Oka. And uh, Oka in Kikamba is Oka. Oka, Oka, Oka. Huh? Oka, uh, Oka, ba? Oka, ba na mitukiwe? Oka, ba? So these are uh, uh, people whom Kalonzo will call at any time and tell them, uh, <laughs> and they will run coming to Kalonzo Mzioka. Because Oka is a Kamba name, Okaba, uh, Twiva, Nababa Yuzuku, uh, Sembera, Kujaraka, Pass. So, <laughs> Oka, that is what all Oka means. Uh, Oka means come. So they will have to come. Kenya is a democracy. Yeah. You cannot be forced to do anything. Even in your house, you cannot force your own children. We are a democracy. We are a democratic society of the Republic of Kenya. So you can either come, and I've told them, instead of talking too much, 
Because some were questioning my credibility of, of, of convening the meeting. Why are they not uh, 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 questioning uh, the business community, the forum of Central Province, which, uh, which summoned them and they went running? And those who are not elected people. <laughs>